There are many, many immune escape mechanisms. What we found is that there's, on the good side, you need to have a good adaptive immunity. Uh, for the immunosuppressive mechanism, this is very variable between patients, between tumors, and there are multiple possible immune suppressive mechanisms which are all playing a role in pushing down the, these good adaptive immune cells. So there's uh, obviously immune checkpoints is one of the you know, immune suppressive mechanism that will prevent T cells from being very active. So immune checkpoints on, on, on T cells. There are immunosuppressive cytokines in the immune microenvironment like IL-10, TGF-beta, these types of things. There are myeloid compartments, so myeloid cells, subpopulations of myeloid cells, MDSCs, M2 macrophages type. Um, um, we can think of other uh, you know, mechanisms associated with hypoxia. Um, lack of tumor antigens or less stress signals. Uh, so there are many, many different uh, uh, immune escape mechanisms, in fact. Uh, and, and the tumor cells are uh, indeed uh, generating also these immune escape mechanisms, like loss of class one expression, for example, all these types of things. So it's, uh, it's a very complex uh, uh, immunosuppressive uh, milieu.